just going to talk uh, quickly about uh, YouTube demonetizing uh, a lot of channels and uh, also kind of getting rid of a lot of uh, like fake news uh, channels as they call them and uh, why I actually even though I've been monetized on some of my videos I uh, think that was a good decision for the people who want to watch YouTube um, yeah so I was demonetized on most if not all of my videos uh, but as I don't get that many views and don't really want that many views that's uh, quite a good thing I mean arguably I got a lot of views on a couple of videos but again I don't really want those views and I'm not looking to get them so it doesn't really affect me the monetization thing and I'm not a YouTube performer, YouTube entertainer, I'm not a YouTuber basically, I'm just some dude who puts up videos, right? And I don't know, I've seen a lot of people complaining about the uh, YouTube demonetization, about it being an infringement of freedom of speech and this kind of thing. Um, I mean, that's debatable, but I mean, YouTube uh, is actually its own private company and is well <laughs> within its legal right to say, well, actually, you know, I don't want you on my platform because it's like if, if I owned a pub or a house and someone came in and said I, I should be allowed to come in because uh, I'm exercising my free right to free speech and free expression and say no, I own this house, get the fuck out. Um, a, corporate, a, a corporate company uh, has the right to uh, change its terms of service pretty much whenever the fuck it wants unless it's on in an ongoing contract with you. And, you know, I can't blame them for doing so. Basically... Uh, the reasons why I think it might improve YouTube, although I've heard some other things that might, you know, co cause YouTube to go to shit, uh, rip the old YouTube, rip the good days, but I think the good days are far from gone, uh, because people like me, for example, are sort of just blogging their lives, and look, I'm just walking around, fiddling around with a camera, I idiots like me are making low quality videos like this. Uh, the only difference between me and a lot of the uh, people who are YouTubers is that they're doing this and they're just clickbaiting. Like, they'll put an image of. So, my, my video title is probably going to be something along the lines of uh, why the new, new YouTube uh, demonetization uh, and sort of, I guess, anti extremism approach and anti fake news approach was a good thing. They probably put something like. Uh, I don't know, what would they put? The demonetization gods of YouTube finally coming to the rescue must be seen. And that's a clickbait, right? And they probably put, you know, um, like, what's it called? A thumbnail, that's the word. I don't know, I don't, I don't use custom thumbnails. I, I don't care. But they probably use a custom thumbnail with, like, uh, I don't know, like an M&M's. You, you know the M&M's from the M&M's ad? Uh, like style figurine with a YouTube logo on it and a big band hammer smashing like uh, I don't know there'd be listed names of people that are popular but kind of just dra dramatized people I guess Leafy is here would be a good example of that uh, the guy that Leafy is here doesn't like I can't remember his name Onision I guess Pe people like that you know people who are just dramatic and this stuff's not really that interesting, uh, and it's just clickbait. Uh, some of it isn't clickbait, but most of it's just clickbait. Those kind of people, yeah, that's the kind of image they use, and that'd be a clickbait video, you know? Uh, like, you get things like top 10 list of whatever, uh, with some shocking, uh, like, picture of something, or like, let, let's, 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 let's have an example. Top 10 uh, facts you didn't know about Mount Mars, and there'll be a picture of an alien on Mars, and you'll think, oh my god, was there aliens once? You watch a whole video to find out. You'll find out there wasn't. They're perfectly allowed to put whatever thumbnail they want as long as it's not copyrighted. And you'll have wasted your time watching a 10 minute video so that they can get money off you and get a million likes. Uh, to me, that really lowers the quality of videos. I'd rather put my crappy videos up on the internet and uh, just have them displayed as they are so people can look and go oh it's just another guy walking around talking about nothing of massive interest yeah because it's more honest it's uh, it's more right I, I don't want people to watch things I do and get their hopes up but but similarly uh, you know there's a lot of shit content out there that's just big because it's clickbait and um, 
Yeah, the demonetization uh, kind of thing is getting rid of a lot of the clickbait titles. Uh, they're demonetizing a lot of the extreme content, which is a good thing, uh, in my opinion, as well. Like the clickbaits of radical mus Muslims uh, destroying my life, something like that, right? That's an example before people lose their fucking minds at me. Um, yeah, basically, uh, that, 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 that's an example. And in the video, it will contain a video of someone uh, just hyping up how evil Muslims are. And you get the opposite video of that, you know, p people who are Muslims uh, having to go, let, let's say the EDL, for example, then a bunch of atheists comment on it, and then feminists, and everybody, you know, has all these massively polarized different op uh, different opinions. You know, y y I, I don't mind that much YouTube being used as a political uh, platform. Well, actually, I actually kind of do, um, mainly because uh, YouTube seems to be just turning into nothing but a uh, drama or a, a website that just hosts drama and a, a political platform which you know it, it's it's kind of just i'm just watching the same videos over and over again like when i watch the uh, anti whatever videos or the pro whatever videos it doesn't matter what side anyone from any of the videos on it's just the same thing here's some evidence to suggest that this isn't so good here are some emotional people to tell you why we don't think it's good and uh, this is my personal opinion and the reason why I'm such a great person and these people are a bad example of the world and you're not them like that is every single video but a, a lot of these videos don't have you know a great deal of uh, I don't know weight to them like they'll say oh we got attacked by someone and when they say we got attacked some guy who for all you know could have been a troll has posted a mean comment on twitter that that's not an attack to me you know when, when i think of an attack like i think of someone punching you in the head or you know like uh, someone emailing you several times saying i'm gonna fucking kill you this kind of thing because let's be real, if someone puts a YouTube comment, or if hundreds of people put a YouTube comment saying, I'm going to kill you, I'm, I'm probably just going to look at it and think, ha, huh, that's really funny. Because it's the internet, and most of the people aren't fucking serious on here, right? So the demonetization is sort of taking away the power of that. Um, and that's good, because it's not a, it's not a political platform. I'd, I'd rather go, if I want to see that on a news channel, or on a political platform, like if they could make a political YouTube instead of just a YouTube, that would be way better. We could divide it there and the mainstream, main YouTube could be riddled with entertainment and education instead of politics and just drama crap. I'm not interested. Like, uh, other examples are, you know, Leafy's here, other people just doing what I'm doing, ranting on about shit online and making it out as if it's really important like let's be realistic this stuff i'm talking about it's not that important it's just youtube you've got your real lives let's be honest like you most of the people on this channel are either here from freaking runescape or from drugs right realistically none of them give that much of a fuck about politics they're just kind of being made to give a fuck about politics because that's sort of hijacking youtube and people are kind of getting made to uh, get into a lot of bullshit. People are talk, chatting shit about each other. Because that's sort of how YouTube was going. And it's good that they're derailing that. They're also... Uh, I know they're changing the algorithms for some of the things. Like uh, TJ Kirk, who was the amazing atheist. Uh, he made some really good videos back in the days. Um, but his new videos are just awful. It's just him basically demanding money and making videos with monetization for the sake of just making a video to make money he's he's not even he's not even hiding the fact really and it's awful because he's put himself into a position where he knows he can just get views and money and he's just shit now like uh, he had some great atheist points you know a lot of these people started off really good and it's all kind of just turning into People just producing junk with catchy titles and kind of just shouting at people. You know, they've got nice cameras and stuff. And people got obsessed with it or people watch it over and over again because it's a violent, toxic, but it's quite addictive to watch. 
And because the clickbaits, right, even though you know everything's clickbait on YouTube and on articles on Facebook, you can't help yourself because what if it isn't clickbait? It's always fucking clickbait, right? It's always clickbait. So, yeah, I'm really happy uh, about the demonetization thing that's going on, uh, to be quite honest. And yeah, just like I say, the whole extremist thing as well, like, there's a lot of tensions that are being... I feel sort of made up, like political tensions that are being made up on the internet that just don't exist. Like people who just sour at a certain group of people uh, making up tensions that don't exist, and then the opposite group does the same. And a lot of a lot of political groups now are making tension on YouTube. Uh, I don't understand why, and it's not helpful because it just kind of it just kind of breeds tension and hatred. Uh, and we should just leave the police to sort this out. If it's found that one group of people uh, does something massively wrong, I have enough faith that probably well, government or locals will just say, nah, fuck them, and that that'd be the end of that ideology. You know, there's there's too many people in the world at stake. Even people who are part of ideologies that are poisonous. Most of the people who are part of a bad ideology you know, grow out of the ideology, accept it shit and decide to help the world and try to combat an ideology. But, you know, they are those few bad apples, really. I don't even know what I'm saying now. I'm just liking the demonetization. I'm liking seeing stuff like this go down, uh, you know, in my channels. A lot of things I've subscribed to, um, like the shit that I've subscribed to, a lot of it, I don't have to see, uh, this is on other random troll channels, by the way. Not on this channel. And it's it's nice. I'm actually seeing entertaining things on YouTube again, you know? Factual things like uh, tutorials. Just entertaining things and music again. It's great going back on YouTube for me. I'm not interested in the political content. I'm not interested in people like myself uh, ranting about nothing, very small problems in the world. Uh, and they don't offer solutions. So what's 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 the point? Or they don't offer real solutions, it's just a troll solution. Ha ha ha, we're funny, they're not. Like, it's, it's not useful to me, you know. It doesn't make me laugh, it doesn't make me smile. And I just kind of watch a lot of these vids. She didn't get demonetized and I'm glad that I probably never have to waste all that time I invested on shit ever again in my life. Anyways, thanks for watching. Yeah, sorry, it was a bit of a rant, but yeah, I just needed to get that out. Um, but yeah. I hope you enjoyed and see you in another video or one. Bye.